straight ahead. All right, thanks, Dean. New tonight, ever wonder what your dog would do if a burglar broke into your home? Well, we put man's best friend to the test. Investigative reporter Tammy Leitner found out which pooches will protect and which ones, well, they just ran off. Tammy, is that right? <laughs> Kent, most of us who have dogs, especially big dogs like mine, assume that they're going to protect us when we're in our own home. But what happens when you leave your house? What would your dog do if someone were to break in? Most homeowners hope this is what their dog would do to an intruder. But if faced with a real live test, will they protect or will they run? We put these dogs to the test. Brutus, Nico, Champ, Buddy, and weighing in at a whopping six pounds, Zorro. Most people would like to believe that their dogs will protect them, but okay, you can give them the job. Leighton Oosthuysen is a professional security dog okay, trainer. So. He owns and operates Partners Dog Training in Cave Creek. Dogs like Jedi take years to train and serious cash. Leighton says people who are dedicated to having a dog as security can spend up to $40,000 training a dog to attack or not attack on command. Oh, sit. For our test, the owners leave the house and drive away. The trainer dresses up as a burglar and then breaks in. First up, Nico, a black Labrador. The owner has no idea what to expect. Nico meets the fake burglar at the door, is friendly, and doesn't even bark. In fact, he wants to play. I, I had a feeling that might happen. You know, some may bark, some may growl, but once you open the door, they'll pretty much welcome you in. Or will they? Champ's owner is absolutely sure he will be protective. And at first, he shows promise when the would-be burglar opens the door. But a few seconds later, Leighton is playing with Champ in the owner's living room. I was pretty sure that he was going to bite him, but he said he let him through and... Let him walk around in the room, so kind of disappointing. But Leighton doesn't think Champ failed the test. The best of all the dogs we've tested so far, um, he, when I pushed through the door and I kind of showed him I was coming inside, he was not going to give space just because of that. Next up, Brutus, who barks, but eventually retreats, leaving the trainer to wander the house freely. The guy came in and Brutus barked for about 10 seconds and then went right up to him and was friendly as could be. Wow. That's not good. And while pit bulls may have the reputation as being ferocious, Buddy showed none of that. In fact, when Leighton pretended to attack, Buddy jumped on him in a playful manner. They're not protective unless they've been trained to be protective. And, and you know, despite the fact a lot of people think they're going to protect them, the truth is that in most cases they won't. And finally, Zorro. Don't let the pink bow fool you. His owner believes he will tear off the intruder's ankles. <laughs> But even though Zorro has the heart of a lion, he backs down and eventually allows Leighton to pick him up as they settle in to watch a little TV. This dog was, was actually in many ways more defensive of his territory than what a lot of the other dogs were. I was confident that he was going to rip his ankles off. But surprised? I am a little surprised. Leighton gives a quick lesson to show Zorro could learn to protect Kerry, his owner. But most likely, he will never reach this level. <laughs> In fact, very few do. It's unfortunately a misconception. About 95% of dogs, unless they are trained, will not protect their owners or the homeowners or the homes that they're in. The bottom line is whether you have a dog that attacks or maybe one with just a ferocious growl, most likely the burglar is going to find another house. Now, if you would like more information about training your dog, whether you want to spend hundreds or thousands, we've put that information on our website. Simply go to kpho.com, click on the link, Five Investigates. I'm Tammy Leitner with CBS Five Investigates. Looks like it might be worth it for some folks. All the cats are smiling out there. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, which diet helps you lose weight and keep it off? Tonight, all new Consumer Reports breaks down which diet will most likely help you drop those pounds. Plus, murder in Las Vegas, a backpack explosion.